welcome back to my channel. It's your Ariana Cache. I'm 19 years old, a content creator, college student, home health aide. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing my Hawaii haul. I'm so excited to show you guys all that I brought for Hawaii, and I'm just going to be showing you guys what I brought, not the stuff that I already had and that I'm bringing. That's going to be in a whole entirely separate video, in like my packing kind of vlog, or my packing video rather. But without further ado, let's get right into it. I don't want to take up too much of your time. Yeah. I'm just going to go through these really quickly because, I mean, they're toiletries, totally you know, I'm pretty sure you don't really care that much. Q-tips because you ears get clogged going swimming and flying and things like that. A Bath and Body Works Body Mist. And this is in the scent Berry Waffle Comb. It smells so good. It smells like what I think fair smells like. And I just love it. Yeah. Body Wash. Travel size so that they can be TSA pre-approved. And this is the Method Body Wash. Love these. And they're so cute. These pH balance wipes because I like to feel nice and clean, especially if I'm going to public restrooms, you know, just to make sure I'm, you know, fresh. A toothpaste, toothbrush, and mouthwash set because you gotta have nice teeth, fresh breath, you know. And I don't like traveling with my regular everyday toothbrush. I feel like it gets germs on it or something. <laughs> Nivea body lotion, and I feel like, I hope this is enough for five days. Um, that's not brought to you, but we'll see. Botanicals, travel size, bug spray, so we don't mess up the environment and things like that. It's plant-based, deep free, all that. Kleenex, a mini cute little Cetaphil face wash. And then I got like so many hand sanitizers because they're on sale. I'm not going to bring all of them, obviously, but I got a lot. Then I am wearing braids on the trip, but I wanted my, you know, braids to stay nice and fresh and clean. We're going swimming in salt water and ocean water, so I want to keep them fresh. So I got some shampoo and technically this leave-in, but I'm going to use this like a regular conditioner. And it's the Shea Moisture mini travel sizes. And I also got these in Target. Everything already has a Target sticker on I'm just keeping it on so it doesn't spill in my luggage. But for the most part, everything is from Target except for a few things. And then I got some edge control. This is the Cream of Nature one. Um, and some mousse to keep those braids nice and fresh. And I actually got this from Amazon because I couldn't find a travel size mousse. This one's 2.4 ounces so it's perfect. I went to a little childhood store of mine, which is Icings, and I ended up getting a puka shell necklace and a puka shell anklet because I don't want to spend too much on it, especially seeing that they're like a little cheap, you know, bohemian vibe accessories and they might get lost in the ocean. I don't want to bring any real jewelry for that reason, but I got this necklace. On focus, there you go. It's really pretty. And then I also got the anklet to go with it, but I will say they're two. This one's like really white and this one's off white. It's okay. And they kind of look different, but it'll work out anyway. I also ended up getting this guest wristlet it is so pretty it's like a caramel color it's a clip-on so it can go onto your uh, waist your wallet i mean your bag whatever and it's also zippered so things don't fall out and it has two card holders in the middle is just open space for coins and cash and this is literally going to be the only wallet i'm bringing on the trip because i don't want to bring a ton of wallet i mean a big wallet or a ton of cards or anything like that don't want to get anything lost I also brought this turban from Amazon, and it's just a really big white turban, so this is how it looks. This really long, really big turban. I always wanted a really big turban because I have a lot of hair to wrap around and just like do different styles with. Honestly, don't know if I'm actually going to wear it there. Um, we'll see what style I'm going for that day, but I'm probably still going to bring it just in case. I like it, so. <laughs> and then last but not least for accessories, I got this bag from Magnolia Boutique. And it was kind of sketchy at first, I'm like, is this website real? Legit. But it came in time, it came really fast actually, and it's pretty good quality. It's like a straw drawstring bag, so the straps look like rope, and so does this drawstring part. It has like uh, faux leather detailing, then on the inside, this is how it looks. It's like a nice cream color, and it does have a pocket. I mean, it's not a zipper pocket, which is what I was looking for, but it was really hard to come across a bag that was like my exact color of straw that I like and the exact faux leather but it will do the job and then you can tighten it real nice and tight like that and nothing can get out and this is going to be like my everyday beach bag when we go there for my beach towels water bottles wallet phone all that other good stuff but into the swimsuits I brought three different swimsuits for this trip and we're going to the beach three times so a different swimsuit for each day you already know um first one I got is from Fashion Nova and I got it because we're supposed to do more water activities than we signed up for, but then we end up changing the itinerary. We're still doing water, some water activities, but, you know, it's fine. <laughs> I end up getting this 
two piece black set so this is like a short sleeve that's the top it's like an athletic bikini so when you're doing things like jet skiing or surfing or whatever the case may be and it's zippered like the white detail zippered whenever you're doing things like that really intense water activities nothing pops out nothing you know comes out to say hello so that's why I really like this one from Shein and I'm really quite pleasantly surprised at the quality of these bikinis. They're really quality, top tier material, and I was surprised. This is the bottom. It's like, if you look closely, I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a ribbed material. And I got white because I just thought it was a really pretty color. And then this is the top. And I thought that was like super cute. And then the other bikini I got from Shein is this nice blue color. Now, now it looked tail online, which I didn't really like the tail, but it was like the best. A cup bra or cup bikini rather that I saw and I was like oh I really like that it's cupped um so I went ahead and got it and then it came in this powder blue color and I was like oh my god I love it I loved it even more when I saw it in person than I did online but this is the bottom it's like kind of rudged right here rudge is that how you say it ruffled whatever and it has like blue flowers on it it's so pretty and then the top has a bunch of support which I'm in love with and it's super cute this is how it looks. It's little straps at the top. I just, I love this one so much. It's like probably one of my favorites. Again, what I'm just grabbing right here is just in front of me. But everything is mostly from Shein. And they're still in their little packages because I was waiting to do this video before I put everything up. And then I take it back down and get a pack, you know. So I was like, should I really put it all up? Who knows? But here's the first item. It is this sheer oversized button up and I thought this is perfect for the beach you know giving me beach vibes giving me uh luxury you know I'm trying to show you guys I'm trying to get it situated but this is how it looks it's oversized and it was like an off-white creamy ivory color and I'm just obsessed with it it's see-through and I can see myself wearing like some shorts you know a little bikini in this you know so it look nice and it's nice and long I really like this one and in this bag we have now, personally, I don't know why, I just don't have beaters or anything like that, or cami tops. So I ordered some because I thought I could use them for the trip and wear them under stuff. But I brought this cami top, this is the first one, it's just nice ribbed material, thin little sleeves that you can adjust. And then it's also, um, what is this, button? Yeah. With that, I also did get this other beater. And this is how it looks, it's nice and thick and pretty good material. I can see myself wearing it a lot for reasons like everyday wear or whatever it's gonna come in handy it's one of those most people use kind of items you didn't just buy them for vacation you can use them a lot it's this maxi skirt and i don't know if you guys can see the bottom of it but it's like it's kind of slip but not really it's just it's really beautiful and i love the pattern of it. it's this blue color and then it gets different patterns at the bottom it is so beautiful and i'm obsessed with it and i have the perfect outfit for it and the perfect occasion for it i can't wait to show you guys it on while I'm there it's gonna be so nice then I ordered this shirt from Hot Topic it is this Lilo and Stitch shirt so on the front it just says Aloha and it has like a little palm tree and then on the back it has Lilo and Stitch on it I was like oh that's so cute if you know me I'm a sucker for Disney stuff I love Disney and I thought this could be paired with so much stuff especially with this color this color is so pretty and just gives me such a happy good island vibe next are these shorts I actually got these from Target this is just some white basic shorts this is how they look nothing really fancy about them no ribs no specialness i just wanted a comfy pair of white shorts that i wouldn't feel very like constricted in these are very they're not really super stretchy but they're like comfortable and soft and you know i can see myself wearing them for a couple hours without getting upset or getting annoyed this sweatshirt from etsy and it just says Hawaii on it and it is so cute and I was like oh my god I can totally see me wearing this on the plane now the last thing I got was some Shein this is well maybe clothes it's not like I'm wearing it outside clothes it is my pajamas and I just got a little set from Shein and it's like a botanical kind of set I guess it has like little plants on it it's like this oatmeal creamy color I just thought it was really pretty and it comes with shorts and you know I was like why not get some more pajamas for my trip? I don't usually typically I wear oversized t-shirts, that's it for to bed, but I want to try something new and get a short set. So I did. I ended up getting this is from Amazon. 
and it is a packing set like a cube set so this is the first thing it comes in the first thing and like they all can just go into each other so it's great for storage and then they have this cute little I'm guessing a laundry bag and I don't know if you guys can see that but it has like writing and a picture on the front it's a picture of a plane it says travel to lighting your life Shh, secret so I think this is actually a lingerie bag but I can see it being used for laundry if need it be it's like zippered or whatever and this one's the same thing the other one did but it's like a flip up one and then there's like several others in total there's eight different packing cubes in here and that is going to be so essential and so helpful for keeping everything organized and if you know me I have OCD I have to have things wherever like in an order so I'm really happy about this purchase and it was really inexpensive and it's gonna save you so much time when it comes to organizing things I also ended up picking up wet ones then I ordered these also from Amazon and these are just like travel uh, toiletry bags and they come in a pack of three my first time getting on a plane was I think my ju junior year no it was like freshman sophomore year and I went to Vermont and I've never been on a plane since then but I really did enjoy myself but I will say on the plane when I was trying to sleep it was super uncomfortable because I didn't have a travel pillow so I decided this time around that I was going to order one it comes in I already took it out I should have showed you guys first but it comes in this cute little pack and I got it from Amazon and it's from the brand Ever Everlasting Comfort and it's made with memory foam. And this is the neck pillow itself. It is so soft and comfy and it has this like part in the front that can actually come off. And also this is zippered so this can be removed so you can wash the outside of it without messing up your memory foam. But it also came with this nice sleeper mask or sleep mask rather to keep out the lights. Some earplugs I guess to help with ear popping and just so you don't hear things on the plane which I thought was so cute and so nice but my camera is blinking so let me hurry up I only have two more things to show you guys and that is these towels from the brand Kakala C-A-C-A-L-A -A -A. and it's made with zero waste and I got these off of Amazon because we are going to a beach in Hawaii people all over the world are still in so I got these for this number one reason right here can you guys see that it's a little pocket it's a zipper pocket and you can hide it very easily in the sand put it upside down so nobody can see it and you can put your valuable items in there like money or your phone or whatever the case may be so it doesn't get stolen at the beach which I thought was very convenient um, the towel itself just is like this gray towel with lines in it it has like tassels at the bottom and it's very very big like it's covering the entire screen kind of big it's super big but I will say like thickness wise like you can see that it's very very thin it's honestly giving dishcloth <laughs> dish towel it's made out of I think Turkish cotton so it's like think of the sand cloud towels with like water resistance but it's good at drying you off and that's also a good selling point for me when I brought it so and it has a good amount of reviews so I'm thinking these are some decent towels and I just wanted to get them for that. The other one is like this black and gray kind of pattern if you guys can see. But yeah. And that is pretty much all that I brought for Hawaii. Me, all that I brought for Hawaii. That was a lot of stuff. But we wanted to be prepared and I plan on traveling more and it's good to have this stuff on hand so the next time we travel we can just, you know, and yes, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm super excited to be going to Hawaii. I'm super excited to be sharing this experience with you guys. And I hope it inspires you to travel more, to have fun. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. And yeah, bye.